live from WATN in high definition, this is a Local 24 breaking news alert. Out of the gate at 6.30, breaking news. Memphis police surrounding a home with weapons drawn. This all happening at Hollywood and Young near the Liberty Bowl. And Local 24's Jeanne Francine working this story for us live at the scene. Jeanne, what are you learning from police? Well, at this point, John, we haven't heard much from police. They're actively working this scene. We can tell you that the house in question is 2588 Young. Right now, we're between Young and Hollywood. You can see the Liberty Bowl Stadium right there. Directly across from it is the house that is in question now. All of the area blocked off right between Southern and Midland. We got out here to the scene around 530, and there were already about 12 units out here, marked and unmarked. So I guess it's safe to say that everything happened around 5 o'clock this morning. When we got here about 15 minutes in police had to push us back they drew out their weapons and they told someone to come out of the house with their hands up now at this time sources are telling me that someone actually barricaded themselves inside of the home and that police were trying to evacuate people from inside of that home but still at this time no word from police to confirm that information we are still out here working to gather more information and we are still waiting to hear back from police and as soon as we do you will be the first to know reporting live gina francine back to you john all right, staying on top of this breaking news with team coverage. Alternate routes, Chelsea's here with that free and time saver traffic. Yeah, as Jeanne just mentioned, we do now officially have Hollywood Street shut down, as you saw, between Southern Avenue and Midland this uh, morning. But as far as alternate routes, uh, you have a couple. C Central is still a good one, East Parkway. You can still use Southern Avenue. Uh, it is, of course, not Hollywood, which is the cut through to Central. So I would use those alternate routes. Of course, you want to give police officers as much space as they need. Uh, so avoid that area if at all possible. As far as the rest of the area, I don't have any other accidents or delays outside of your normal delay at 240 West and Poplar. Uh, so it's pretty quiet in the Sonic Traffic Center this morning. Uh, the rest of the 240 loop still moving smoothly. So if you are about to head out the door, it is looking pretty good for that early morning commute. But I'm going to continue to track it and keep you up to date with your time saver traffic.